garden is called the Afia Community Teaching Garden. Okay. So people can come here and learn how to grow food and this kind of thing. But we grow the food for the Growing Food Together CSA, a community supported agriculture. And that model allows us to uh, invite people in to either pay or work to get weekly shares of food from May until um, the end of October. We have the, um, the crops. We also have bees for honey. Um, you know, we, you know, like I said, we produced last year, we produced 10,000 pounds of food or more for about 75 families. These are brassica plants, greens, kale, and broccoli. They're easy to grow, and you can get a lot of them in a short period of time. It's not lost on him. They're also credited with fighting cancer. We're in the Park Heights section of Baltimore, Maryland, and behind me you can see urban decay. But what this garden is, is an oasis. Our program is called Urban Oasis, and yes, uh, it is, like I said, the reality of a food of apartheid. You can see the, the vacant buildings, the neglect there, decaying and all that, and you know, our goal was to produce what you see. It's a significant outcome to show everybody it's an advocacy to show everybody that this can happen anywhere. This same garden right here once was called Needle Park because people shot up and people were found dead in this same location. So we like to say we went from needles to nourishment. So if you can imagine that uh, 20 years ago, people were you know, sitting out here um, doing drugs, shooting drugs, dying on the drugs, and now we come to this. If you can see this happen, it can happen anywhere else in the, in the, in the country, but particularly with our focus being on Baltimore, it can happen anywhere in this, in this city. The transformation is all around you. In these boxes are colonies of honeybees which pollinate the plants. They also harvest the honey which they share. Back to basics to me in this context means yes, you can see where your food comes from, number one, but the actual uh, physical part of being in the garden is the idea of being grounded and next to earth so, that, so there's a mindfulness piece of it that we promote here. Curiosity is all flowers can hope for in an area that hope has eluded. In Baltimore, I'm Charles Robinson for Your Money and Business.